Hi, welcome on next video in Protractor and Angular series. This time I will tell you more about Cucumber library, which can be used as replacement for Jasmine. We will start with configuration and uh, we set up Cucumber in our project. I will follow this great guide how to set up Angular and when testing with Cucumber. And after that, I will explain you what we configure and what is exactly is Cucumber and why you might use it. So, let's go step by step. And the first step will be install required dependencies. Okay. You might have an error with that command because of the mm, types. And if you have this notification, please just use another command where you directly define types types chai and cucumber. And now you should be able to install all the dependencies. Okay. Next step is, uh, is about types. And we need to replace this by cucumber types. Next thing is to update the protractor configuration file. And we need to add files called features. And Cucumber as framework. Cucumber options. And remove all Jasmine stuff. And now we will start creating our test cases. Now we will create these files and then I will explain to you what they are. This old we can remove. the page object step definition And now we only need to launch our test. But before we do it, I need to change this uh, assertion. And um, the test is about checking this title. Um, so we should replace this with welcome to 
end-to-end -end testing. And also be sure that you will have the right Selenium version on the path. And now should be everything fine. So let's check if everything is correct. Okay, everything works. And there you can see that we have one scenario and three steps, which all passed. And about scenarios and steps, I will tell you right now. But before I do it, I will also um, change configuration for Firefox. As you can see, this also works. And now we can talk about Cucumber library. As I mentioned before, Jasmine is default end-to-end -end testing framework, but you can replace it, for example, with Cucumber. And Cucumber is behavior-driven development, BDD, testing library. Thanks to this, you can write your test cases in a more descriptive way. It means that you can focus more on the business side or the features you want to provide than how the system works. I will refer to this documentation and I will describe what I have done in the, in the project. So we have these features directory and there we can find this feature description and the purpose of the feature is describe what feature has the system and what does it mean so for example we can this feature guess the word um, and there we have the description what is this how it um, can be used on what is the value of this feature. And when we go to app feature, we have simple go to the page. The description is display the title. And then we have the scenario. And scenario, when we go deeper into documentation, we can find our steps and these steps are just in scenario so this keyword basically group all the steps that need to be done to show or test this feature and we have a lot of um, steps as you can see given when then and or but but in this example simple example we have only given and given describe what is the precondition or what we should have as an initial step then we have when we describe what we need to do so basically the action and the last will be then and this is simple result of what of a lot of our steps before of course we can have two steps here with keyword when also we can have more with given keyword and with van. It's okay. You can have as many steps as you need. And thanks to this, 
way of writing test you have more business uh, you have deeper business understanding and what feature we're developing so this is the main advantages the main advantage of of cucumber framework okay also you have you can have helpers like this app object page where you will describe all your steps which are included in your test so go back to our scenario these are references to the steps and steps are written in steps directory and now you can see that we have this keyword here given when and then and this is very important because this should match with the features and the scenarios which you have described so we have this I'm on the page and here is I'm on the page where we used our helper which is app page more of course you can see and you can uh, try with this documentation but for now with this tutorial it's all let me know if you want more about cucumber and some more complex stuff thank you and take care bye